Hey, hey, how's it going, everyone? Welcome to Uta Luke Garage today. Today, videos we're going to be applying the Busa Coat Soft 99. I know it's been out for a while and uh, it's supposed to last up to 12 months. It's very popular that I've seen, but I never tried it. So I figured, you know what? Winter's coming. Uh, today is October 28th, and we might as well put this on the truck and see how it lasts for the winter with the salt and stuff like that on the road and the snow. Well, we'll just see. We'll do updates on it also on this product right here. That's where we're going to apply it. Check it out. We got it all ready to go. Um, we stripped off the canoe wax that was on it from the Auto Fanatics secret weapon. Look how clean that is. And then but basically, you know, I'm sure you guys already know, it's supposed to last up to 12 months. You can actually apply this stuff when it's cool out too. I think around, don't quote me, 45, 50 degrees, something like that. And basically, you're just going to apply it. And then if it's warm out, you're going to let it sit for 5 to 15 minutes. And then if it's cooler out in the winter, you're going to let it sit for 15 to 20 minutes just play with it yep we're gonna make sure we wear some gloves too i'm not even gonna clean my microsoft towels so i'm gonna just toss them to this um i'm watch other videos on it they're basically that's what they recommend tossing them out and that's what we're gonna do so um yeah we're gonna apply this on here and we're gonna do some updates through the winter basically wipe it on and then we'll let it sit for a few minutes today it's like almost 60 so we'll let it sit we'll see if it hazes up and then we'll take it off check it out it's pretty cool and i picked this up in amazon the paste whack old school stuff so if you enjoy doing uh, the old school and putting on the paste and this is for you it looks pretty good all right we're gonna get set up and we'll apply the hood and we'll show you guys even comes with the sponge and we're gonna use it there it is open it up check it out it's got that green i think old school face wax supposed to put on thin the two say try to watch the black areas not to get it on there we're not gonna tape it i'll just be careful the best we can leave it on sit for a few minutes goes on nice it does go on thin you can feel it Oh, nice and thin. Yeah, it's nice. It's been a while since I used the paste wax. Oh, can't pick up no. Got a little smell to it. Almost like a kerosene a little bit. Goes on nice. We'll see how long it lasts. For the winter yeah it looks pretty good what do you guys think you guys ever use this anyone watch this use it let us know in the comments below you used it how did you like it and then we'll continue to go we'll make this a quick video basically not this is not going to be really a how to it can if anyone wants to try it mainly going to put it on here and show the results we're going to test it for the winter Goes on nice. Oh yeah. It's gonna look good. Protect it up. Yeah, I know there's a bunch of videos on this, but you know what? I never tried it. I figure why not? Let's try it out. And see how long right, it's been on here about 10 minutes. We're gonna take it off. Yeah, I got some of my it does make it white a little bit. Alright, let's take it off. It's not bad comes off pretty decent i mean like a just like a paste wax actually it comes off you gotta put a little bit of elbow grease in it but yeah it's coming off nice actually decent yeah not bad not bad hopefully you guys can see that yeah it comes out nice it's gonna be hard to see if this is uh shining up real good because of the color but uh, our big test will be on the updates and see how this is holding up for us. And I'm pretty uh, confident that this wax will hold up great for the winter from all the videos that I have seen on this product. And I just wanted to try it out and see. You know, try a, a wax, paste wax from Japan. It's pretty cool. Need to try some of their soaps and that, but that looks good. Give it a nice little shine. You know, it's cooler out now, so it's gonna take a little bit longer to dry. A couple spots I got a little heavy, but it came right out. Actually, those spots it got heavy. I gotta get the middle. Yeah, right there's a little heavy, came right out. A little bit of elbow grease, no problem. 
get a nice little some exercise waxing up with the paste wax which is always a good thing yeah, that looks good. yeah it looks nice all right we're gonna continue to go um hey show them the uh other side i got the uh i have the door in the back already applied this stuff goes on quick i mean i got most of the truck pretty much the stuff applied except for the fenders and the door on the other side in the roof but yeah, it looks good. Check that out. Now it's gonna rain. It's supposed to rain on Wednesday. Maybe if it does rain on Wednesday, I won't edit this video and then we'll use the rainwater, I think Wednesday, and we'll see what the how it's beating before I have this video out. That yeah, looks good. Alright, we're gonna continue to go. I gotta get going so we don't lose our lights. Look at that. Always losing the light. Chrome it up. Shining it up. Even put on the, the headlights. It's looking good, man. It gave it a nice shine. Alright, check it out. We're all done. Didn't take long either. Maybe 30 minutes. Put it on there. I had help from the kid. Uh, but about 30 minutes. Put it on there let it sit for a little bit and then take it off with it being cool out too it dried pretty quick too so that that made it nice but check it out get a nice deep shine looks great on the chrome awesome product right here i'm glad i uh tried it out busa coat soft 99 now this is the old version if i didn't mention it this is the old version still um there's a new version out now but i didn't see it on amazon the new version i don't know if it's out for uh on amazon or if we can buy it here in the states yet i'm not sure if you know let us know in the comments below and then what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna let this settle till tomorrow and i'm gonna do a water test tomorrow i'm gonna treat it like a sealant letting it cure for at least 16 hours or so and after work tomorrow i'll do it and then tomorrow's supposed to be really nice and then uh wednesday i believe the temperature is supposed to back down to 45 and then this weekend's gonna be in the 40s also and because I, I got try to get some more detailing done this weekend um other things too trying to with this weather that's why i want to hear you get a nice coat on there it looks good so uh stay tuned tomorrow we'll do the water test on it and then if it is raining wednesday like they said it's going to i'll uh i'll take some footage of the rain on the on the truck if it does uh rain so all right we'll uh we'll let this settle so continue watching and comment right here what do you guys think of it i like it man actually went out nice oh i did notice too real quick if you use a little bit too much you will get a little bit of dusting um i hit a couple spots with the black trim it came off uh pretty decent i didn't really have an issue with the half and the tape and everything off i did the bumper stuff like that the kids taking off the rest on the roof and we got it pretty good man it got a nice shine to it nice deep shine and now if you watched the video before this one we used uh, uh auto fanatics secret weapon one step and that had canuba wax in it so before we applied this we washed it with dawn soap and then i used summit racing wax and grease remover um i had that stuff when i uh, painted a trans am in the garage um a few years ago but uh, that stuff works really good getting rid of some old wax or sealant that you have on your vehicle because you can feel it when i was putting this on you can feel it drag a little bit where the paint was dry there was no protection on there so that works so i know the paint was pretty clean before we applied this all right well uh well stay tuned for the water test tomorrow night time All right, it's raining out right now for the Fusa coat. Check it out. Look at those beads. Man, that's all we've been doing is raining. Now, I did not do the hose water test. Uh, do, I'll do that on the update. It's just the weather. It's been raining a lot, so I wasn't able to do it. But let's check out these tight beads around it. I haven't put it on the windshield. All the windows. Oh, the door. Ooh, the wind. 
Hey, it's nasty, y'all. Chrome. Man, this thing beads nice. Looks cleaned. All right, guys, that's it for this video on the Fusa Coast. Fusa Coat. Right here, South 99, you can get it at Amazon. Um, I appreciate you guys watching this video. And uh, yeah, check it out, comment what you think about it, share it. And if you're new here, join the channel. We like to test out products, even if the products have been out for a while. Um, so a lot of them are just new to us, you know. It's hard to buy every product out there and keep up with a lot of new stuff out there because there's a lot of great products out there. It's just, uh, I just can't buy all of them and test them out. Just got to do some here and there, you know. And that's it. And I've been wanting to test this product out. This kind of reminds me of some old school wax that we'd used in the 80s. Uh, used boat wax back then. And that's what, what it was called, boat wax. And this kind of reminds me of that. Just like it kind of like maybe that call night. I think it's what nine nine fifteen or something like that. Um yeah, like that. So yeah guys, appreciate it, man. You guys have a great one.